great to be here and yes, youth has launched, but it's only just the start, isn't it? Um, the youth has just put uh, a whole new complex on, on Manatech. You can turn around and as Nicole said, you can take some photos, some before and afters, and everybody knows whether they want to look like that or like that. We can see whether we want um, a beautiful clear complexion and, and it's turning back the clock for people that we didn't think we could help, people in their 80s. I actually help one lady and um, be sure and take out uh, a camera with you or your phone and take a photo of before and after because if you take the time to do that, perhaps in one month's time, it'll be like this lady said to me, did you doctor the photos? Well, I've got to say, I am a dinosaur with computers, so I had no idea. I don't know how to doctor a, a photo, let alone <laughs> do something like that. So I hadn't doctored the photos, but when she's seen the results that she was uh, achieving, and quite often when we look in the mirror, we don't see the results the way we do from a camera, simply because we always think we look that good. <laughs> and, and we're a bit, you know, fooled by that. But what I want to say to everybody, set yourself up for success. The reality is if you're not prepared when you walk out the door and then you have to go back again, you're not setting yourself up for success. All you need to do is get this tiny little thing and print a few off and people can see and you can ask anybody for an opinion. I was at the dentist the other day and I've got an appointment with the um, lady that was sitting behind the desk. I just showed her these and asked for her opinion and she said, could this really work that well? And it's not going to make my, my eyes set like cement? Nope. <laughs> and so she wanted to know more. Um, the thing is that Manatech has brought out beautiful tools for us. So I suggest a little thing like this, a little thing like this, and a little thing like this. DVD. If you've got those in your pocket today, right now, let me know. How many have got them right now with them? Have a look, guys. Have a look at the people that are holding up their hands. They're ready for any opportunity that, that comes along. And let's, let's think about that. When preparation meets opportunity, that's when magic happens. So make sure you're ready for any opportunity that comes along. When we talk about the tools, Dr. Kassia is really highly regarded in the skincare industry. And Manatech, once again, has Dr. Kassia telling the story. I happened to go with my mum to the doctor and before I walked out the door, she was an all-star because she is opening a skincare clinic and I had an appointment with her um, partner in Kew, who's uh, got another big skincare clinic. So don't be afraid to speak to professionals because we've got the highest of high professionals behind our products. It's a bit like having Ben Carson speak about glyconutritionals. Dr. Kassia is just so highly regarded in that area as well. So we've got everything on our side. And the one thing that I love about Manatech, we have third party validation. You know, Dr. Kassia, Dr. Ben Carson, they're not part of Manatech as such but they're talking about our products and being part of the, the solution for the world today. And when you go out and we, we create uh, a time to meet people, I've found that it's really easy to have one-on-one -on -one conversations with people or have an in-home or have VIP nights and have fun with it. You know, you create the atmosphere. And that atmosphere is really important to create. You can walk in, you can have a high tea, ladies or you, and gents, or you can turn around and have some champagne and some labna cheese that you may have made the night before and make it homely and wonderful, you know, to walk into. Because I'll tell you this, the people that walk into your home and attend any one of your meetings, they won't remember what you said, they won't remember what you did, but they will always remember how you made them feel. So make sure you're Manatech, because you're Manatech to those people. And uh, we've got a great opportunity. And I've got to tell you that we need to tell the whole story when we tell the story of um, youth, not just a little bit of it. And it's very easy to open up about the business. I had a lady that actually tracked me down off Facebook from our church. She said, I want that stuff that you're talking about and sharing with people on, on Facebook. And um, she said, I don't want to know about the business. I don't want to do that stuff. Anybody had that result? Yeah. Always, don't we? A lot of people stop there. But I said, Lynn, I understand that. I understand where you're coming from. But do you mind if I show you the whole picture? 
Is that easy to say? You bet. And by the time I'd finished the whole picture, because most people don't know what they're saying no to, she might always be a consumer, but I also say you may know somebody that this is going to open doors for them that you wouldn't believe. Because Manatech is a bit like Pandora's box. Every one of us, all the ones sitting down here in the front row, all the presidentials you've seen last night, all walk through the same door as you did. They all walk through at that level. But there's room at the top for everyone to rise to where you want to go. That's the opportunity we have hold of. We're just ordinary people, but boy, do we have an extraordinary opportunity in Manatech. And youth has just opened it up like a whole new blossoming flower. It's just wonderful. The difference with the people, the ordinary people that walk in that door, they have a vision for their future. They have a focus for what they want to do, and they have a commitment. But most of all, we have a heart for Manatech. You know, you couldn't prize Manatech away from me with a crowbar. <laughs> I often say, I, uh, I think Manatech chose me, not I chose Manatech. And it goes to the heart, and you know you're in the right place at the right time, and this is why. Because we need those glyconutrients in our body today. We will need them in 20 years' time. We'll need them in another 20 years' time even more and in another 20 years' time. So I know what I'm setting up for the future of my grandchildren and great-grandson is going to be solid. And you have too. You've got that, that uh, conviction and that understanding that what you're doing is going to work for a long, long time. My message to everybody is you can too. <clears throat> if you've set up meetings for next week and we turn around and say to people as we, we're talking about youth, um, you know, as we're talking about this, I know people are going to jump into your mind about who you would like to have seen, uh, have here today and have them see what, what we're talking about today. The minute you open that up to people, it's a bit like saying, don't think of the black cat. Everybody just had a thought of the black cat. Um, they start thinking of people that they'd like to introduce it to. So make sure you introduce those little things into what you're talking about. Um, and <clears throat> when, we, when you finish, make sure you have time to sit down with that person one-on-one -on -one and then talk to them about, did anyone come to mind that, that you would like to know about what we've talked about today with the youth and just how it can benefit people. One of my loves is to see what it's doing for, for kids with acne, knowing that they're not going on to that drug, Roaccutane, um, for those that know about that. <laughs> it's a bit of a scary drug. And so we can do so much to change people's lives and open up that Pandora's box for anyone. But you can too. The, the reality is that the lives we live today, um, being here amongst all this technology, uh, going to, to Disneyland and seeing what Walt Disney created, that was a magic moment for me with Manatech. Because I walked into a room and up on the, on the wall was this beautiful drawing of what Disneyland was, was going to be like before the first so, um, soil was, was turned. Walt Disney had an idea. He had a vision for the future. And we enjoy that vision today. It's our opportunity to have a vision for our future and our children's future and Australia's future and the world's future and see how we can change lives. There's nothing more purposeful, there's nothing more satisfying the knowing that we're making a difference in children's lives around the world, because they're our future. And we're living today the dreams that other people dreamed. So think about what sort of world we'll create with youth. And go out, I'm going to challenge everyone today. Go out today. <clears throat> go out tonight, in between the break. And think of three people that you can ring and book youth presentations with next week. Who's up for that challenge? Not many hands. Come on, guys. Next week, three people. I can guarantee you two of them will change that appointment, but make three at least, OK? And we'll see how we can change the world together. Thanks very much. Please give it up for bronze presidential Lynn Lane. Now, I was a bit quick before introducing Mandakini, the poor girl. She's just been on the stage rocking this place, um, so I didn't give her much time to get changed. So can I now please ask you to put your hands together again for a person who's got a wealth of information. She is our lovely presidential director, Mandakini.
Now, thanks, Mandakini, for getting changed so quickly and getting back here on this stage. Now, I know you've had some great stuff happening with youth, and you personally find it's just so easy to approach people. Um, and I know you've had some great stuff happening with your team, haven't you? Yeah. Um, yeah, what's happened for us uh, with youth is that it's such an easy product to talk about. And um, some of the girls in the team really took. We've got Sonia and uh, Anita and Bronwyn and Helen. And we even have Lynn in Orange, who's not here. She's already just did a youth presentation yesterday and joined four ladies. Wow. She's, while we were here, she just joined four ladies yesterday after a youth presentation. So we're finding that the conversation is easier. As a diehard Ambritos lover, sometimes it's a bit hard to see people that really need the product, but they won't spend the money on Ambritos, but they'll spend it on youth. But what to do, at least you're starting the conversation. Um, it's great to have this, it's good to be organized. I'm finding that it's good to be organized, especially if we're gonna go to parties. So to have the whole box organized of everything you need, so you don't have to think about it every single time, have the forms ready, because four out of five are gonna join, have it all ready. Um, it appeared that champagne with the ladies <laughs> was very positive, had very positive impact. It made it very friendly and very uh, willing to do something about ordering. <laughs> as much as we didn't try to, as much as we didn't try to bring the optimal health, because Boat Short encouraged us not to talk about the other products, it was just automatic. Because the girl that you know, the girls, if they had good results in the pro with the products before, they couldn't help themselves. So the conversation already went to product, and they got youth and product. The other very successful thing that we've done, which is not duplicatable and maybe a bit of hard work, but it was very successful, was a high tea. That was, we did it as a pre-launch. Women cannot say no to high tea. The RSVP rate is really high, and um, it's easy to call and say, to make sure that they're coming, because you're not just calling to nag, you're calling to make sure that they have a spot, that you have enough good food for them, and enough, um, yeah, so um, that, was, that was easy. We've done a few other things. So it's just an easy conversation and being organized. There were a few other tips that we got in, at um, Manifest. There was a lady from a presidential from Canada. She talked about uh, cards to, and having before and after photos. That's been a great tool um, for our team. So you just have the before and after. Lucky we have Helen on one of our one of our team members, she was very courageous and just did half of her face and had amazing results. So going with before and after pictures of somebody, I actually know this person, seems to have a great impact. Sonia has her before and after photos on the phone, so if they don't listen to her first round after the photos, she says, okay, let me show you my photos. And then they go, to, <laughs> that's when they cross the line, okay, wow. So. Yeah, that's been um, some of the things that have happened for us. So some people in the team that were struggling with optimal health, suddenly youth gave them a whole new look on life. They can run with the business and, um, yeah. <laughs>